Have you ever wondered what the future will be like? Will world hunger be a thing of the past? Will disease be eradicated? Will we finally figure out how to domesticate sloths? Welcome to Reading with Matt Cherry. I'm your host, Matt Cherry, your go-to guy for recommendations on the best and brightest and undiscovered reads. For as long as writers have been, well, writing, they've imagined all kinds of possible futures. Some of the greatest minds in literature have given us utopian futures, dystopian futures, even John Travoltian futures. Today, we'll be taking a look at one of these imagined futures in Gun with Occasional Music by Jonathan Lethem. So who is Jonathan Lethem? Well, just like me, he's a critically acclaimed and award-winning author who is known for... Sorry, just getting an update here. I am not critically acclaimed. Back to Jonathan Lethem, an amazing author who's known for his ability to take an established genre and give it a fresh new spin. <sighs> he began his career by doing that in 1994, when he took the hard-boiled characters and dialogue of famed detective novelist Raymond Chandler, mixed it up with the bonkers futurism of Philip K. Dick, writer of Minority Report, and gave us the excellent Gun with Occasional Music. Set in near-future San Francisco and Oakland, California, the book follows Conrad Metcalf, a PI who, just like any great noir detective, is damaged, self-destructive, and deeply cynical. But we've all heard that story before. So what makes this book so unique? Well, the strength is in its setting. Lethem builds a world here that is populated with evolved animals who are members of society and filled with drugs that seemingly the entire population is addicted to, not to mention the fact that this world is policed by lawmen who monitor citizens by their karma levels, finding people karma points every time they commit a crime. Karma police. It's definitely a new world, and Lethem uses all this future tech to touch on lots of relevant issues in some really clever ways. To sum it all up, it's not the what that will grab you about this book, it's the where. All these great elements come together to form a fully realized and lived in place, a future filled with the new and the unknown. Yet strangely enough, kind of familiar. If you're still on the fence about whether or not to read this book, here is a list of awesome things in it. Rabbits in three-piece suits, floating pens, children with adult bodies called baby heads, talking kittens, yes, if you're on the hunt for a new take on a classic genre, don't delay. Plan a future with one of literature's hidden gems, Gun with Occasional Music. Yeah, rabbits in three-piece suits. Yes, I can afford one. Wow, I think. If you want to learn about more great books, don't forget to subscribe to the Bookwitty channel. And let me know what you think of Gun with Occasional Music by adding your review in the comments section below.